Uh, hey guys, it's m and welcome back to another video. First off, I want to say thank you all so much for subscribing, the comments, the likes, the views. You guys are unbelievable. Um, first off, I just want to thank you all again, um, not only for supporting me on this channel, but the other channel as well. We're almost up to 2,000 subscribers on my original channel, which is in the description below. So if you guys want to go subscribe to that, I haven't been really uploading a lot on that channel because... One, I've just been too tired, and I'm barely being able to put all these videos together because of work. So, um, anywho, this is going to be box number two, and you guys are going to see that, um, ah, something in my eye, okay. You guys are going to see that in the last video when I gave you, like, guys, like, a little preview of the second box, there's a lot of replicas, as in, you know, two or more of the same figures. So the two or more of the same figures are right here. Like Rikishi and all that, um, and most of them are just in there that I don't know the names of, and they're like also like WCW figures like that one, like Psycho Sid or Christian or uh, Test. Bam Bam Bigelow was a uh, the original, you know, the same one that I already showed you guys, and like uh, uh, what the hell is his name? Goldberg. So also, just one reminder. If you guys see the same figure as you saw in the last video, like the same exact same exact figure, it's because when I was making a, a WWE wrestling video, I had in order to get all those figures right there, I had to move them to find what superstar I needed for the matchup for the show. So that's why I had to put some in there in that box. So that's probably if you see like any voice crack Jesus if you guys see any um, the same figures on the last video that's that's why it's because I had to mix them up first off that's a rare ass double pack that I got from um, I think it was I don't even know what website I got it from I think it was eBay double slime series 4 Wrestlemania China and Jericho with the Intercontinental Championship with the WWF sign. And then we got Rock and uh, Billy Gunn over there. But uh, you guys will see that in the packaged videos. As in the, 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 the if I stop stuttering, if the, the box, the wrestling figures that are already in the boxes. So I'm going to do the same exact thing as I did last time. So Goldberg, oh, ignore the noises downstairs on top of that. Plus, my brother's not in the room, so you're just going to hear a lot of dogs barking. Kane, you got Goldberg, uh, Brock Lesnar, Jerry the King Lawler, Steve Blackman. A lot of these guys are like either suit. Oh, by the way, I had to put these guys together because they both had the WWE Championships. They put the shirt up, WWE Championships, which I thought was pretty sick. They actually came with those when I ordered them. Very first wrestling video I ever made, as in on YouTube on this channel, was with Hardcore Holly. Then you got um, Scotty Too Hotty, Steven Richards, Seven McMahon with Vince, and then you got Rafael Hefner. I almost dropped my camcorder. That'd have been awful. Stone Cold Steve Austin with the knee pads and knee brace. Then you got uh, Kurt Angle, and then you got uh. McFoley with a WF Attitude Era jacket on. Booker T, you got Jamie Noble with the WWE microphone. And then you got The Rock, you got a badass Ruthless Aggression Jeff Hardy with Ruthless Aggression uh, Just a Big Loser, JBL. And then you got Billy Kidman. And then if we go all the way down to road number two, old Triple H grew up with him. Um, and then you got Scotty Too Hotty, uh, Travel Guerrero, another one from my childhood, Rey Mysterio. And then you got another Ric Flair, grew up with him as well, Miss Big Foley, and him as well, Eddie Guerrero. Then you got Christian, you got an old ass Randy Orton figure. And how do you know it's Randy Orton? Says it right on his ass cheeks. So, <laughs> then you got uh, another Devon Dudley. You got, honestly, you guys, I have no idea who this figure is. So, if you guys want to let me know. Who this guy is in the um, the comments below will be uh, amazing. Another badass uh, Ruthless Aggression figure, uh, Carlito. And then you got old Shane McMahon figure along with it and another uh, JBL APA. Kane, grew up with him. Same thing with that RVD. He's, these are 
like the top two superstars in G. Uh, not oh my god, I almost said GTS wrestling. That'd have been awful. Um, <laughs> you guys obviously can tell I'm a fan of Grim Story Show. Um, and uh, WWT. Then you got Chris Benoit, another uh, deluxe aggression. It's almost like an elite nowadays. Uh, John Morrison. You got Rhino. You got Cactus Jack or Mick Foley. Mick Foley. He's got so many damn gimmicks. Then you got Maven. Maven. Uh, I don't really like that figure only because he's just looks weird, man. Uh, he's like, fuck you talking about. <laughs> okay. And then you got Miz before he was actually the Miz. And then you got oh, don't be blurry ass bag. Focus. Thank you. Then you got Edge. Get the fuck out of here. Then you got uh, Ken Shamrock, another Scotty Duhati. Uh, what the fuck's his name? William Regal. And row number three. Now I'm just going to start zooming up because I kind of give up breaking my back here. So you got Focus, dipshit. Oh, what the hell's his name? El Snow. I have no idea who that figure is, so if you guys want to let me know. Kurt Angle. No idea who that figure is. Badass CM Punk. Very first CM Punk figure I've ever gotten. Chris Masters. Another Triple H. Uh, Ric Flair. You got Booker T. Bubba Ray Dudley. RVD. John Cena before he was really John Cena. Another John Morrison that I actually grew up with. Uh, Bubba, not Bubba Ray. Devon Dudley. And then you got Grandmaster. You got, I think it's Victoria next to him. And then you got Lita as well. So yeah, and then you got Big Show, an old Big Show. You got, uh, what the hell, Finley. Then you got Batista, very first Batista figure. And then I got Triple H, Jim Ross. And then you got Eddie Guerrero with the WF microphone. And then you got Edgy McWedgie with the sunglasses. And then the fourth row is another uh, Booker T figure. So we'll zoom up here. Then you got Hurricane. Then you got Viscera, big figure, big dude. Um, another freaking McFoley. Mr. Kennedy, another John Cena. Chris Benoit, I grew up with both, all, all three of these guys right here. Stone Cold, William Regal, and uh, Chris Benoit. But actually, William Regal, when I was using when I was a little kid, he used to be a referee because he only looked like a referee, and I didn't have a referee at the time. So, And then you got... Um, Joey Mercury, no, not Joey Mercury. What the hell is his name? He tag teamed with um, John Morrison. Oh, Johnny Nitro, I think his name was. Then you got uh, uh, Scott Hall before he was, you know, what the fuck's his name? And then the whole NWO right there. You got Hulk Hogan. You got Kevin Nash, Scott Hall, or Razor Ramon. Um, and then you got Christian. Oh, that rock figure I grew up when I was a little kid. Dolph Ziggler, I don't really like, I don't understand how, I'm just going to use his name. I don't understand how Grimm likes these figures so much. I mean, they're very detailed and everything, but I just hate the way they, they move and the way they, uh, I don't know, I just don't like them. I'd rather use these guys before I'd ever use these guys. I might, I might actually start collecting them. Hey, leave a comment down below or like on this video if you guys want me to start collecting those as well. The newer figures as well. I might not have any room in here, but then you got Trish Stratus, and then who she got Major Camel though, uh, <laughs> and then you got uh, Taz. You got a badass a deluxe cane, deluxe figure. Hell yeah! And then let's go here to the bitches. Just kidding. Um, Molly Holly, and then you got I don't know who this bitch is to be honest. She looks like an announcer of some sort. She got the microphone. I don't. I don't remember her. I don't, she's not Stacy Kibler. I can't be Stacy Kibler. I don't think so. And this is Trish, I think. Trish Stratus. Yep. And then, you know, removable clothes. Oh, my God. Um, give me the real life Trish Stratus. I'll be okay. Okay. And then you got Kurt Angle. Another Kurt Angle, but that's ruthless aggression. That's just regular Kurt Angle. Then you got, um, what the hell is his name? Carlito. I don't know who the hell that is. I think that's Paul London, maybe. RVD. Matt Hardy with the old uh, camo pants, Chris Jericho, and another badass RVD figure. And last but not least, this scared the shit out of me. This is one of those, um, this is a big show, but when he was a, you can, like, talk, they talk when you move them. And I was just fucking around, moving his head around, and I scared the shit out of me. Showtime. Scared.
the shit out of me. I about pooped. And then you also have you can bend his arm. See, he talks. I'm sorry, I'll crunch your leg then. Then you bend his leg. I'm just gonna be an asshole and not do it. I mean, you really gotta fucking crunch there. Fuck's sake, big show. You big hoe. Okay. Whoa! God damn. Okay. Well, yeah, that's that's all the figures in that box, you guys. Besides those extras, the uh, you know the ones that. Is that a? What kind of figure? Is that? Oh, that's, that's a Christian figure. And you know, Bam Bam Bigelow and all that. That's pretty awesome. So hit that like button. Um. Oh. Oh. Before I want. Before I go, you guys. I know you guys want to see the other um, ring sets, um, play sets, all that shit. It, but you see that big box behind me right there. Though that's not a box. That's all wrestling figures, right there. So, and then on top of that, there's all that big pile in the, the corner over there. That's more wrestling figures. So I got a lot more to show you guys. But box number three is gonna be right there. Which all the those are old. I mean, like old, old. Those are nothing compared to these. Um. But I wanted to ask you if you guys wanted to see my wrestling gear as well, like all the stuff I ordered from um, WrestlingSuperStore.com. Um, yes, like all the tables, all the stuff that you guys, if you guys want to see that, hit the like button, please, and let me know and share this video as well. And um, personally, I don't like ringside collectibles. I know you can use discount code GRIM to save 10%, but stop that shit. Thank you. Um, I don't like the way they have everything lined up because you know I want to go find that uh and you guys are like oh Aaron you you've ordered from ringside collectibles before that I have seen the video yes I ordered weapons not figures because the reason why I didn't order the figures is because it's like I'll go if you go on Google images and type in old WF figures or whatever sometimes if you click the the image it'll show the website and so it'll say ringside collectibles you go to click on it and they don't have anything. They only have new shit. WrestlingSuperstore.com has old shit plus new shit. So, I'm eh, just saying. And they have a way bigger um, selection of weapons and gear. More than ringside collectibles. Throwing it out there. But, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to check out the description below for more videos. You guys don't forget to stay awesome. See you guys later.